uh, Colorado's Coffee and Crepes uh, is, uh, we sell fresh crepes, fresh coffees. Uh, they're made fresh every time. Uh, we try to do um, something different for every crepe that we do. So as you can see that every crepe that we have has something special about it. Uh, maybe like some might have pineapple, some have uh, strawberries and udo peaches, chicken uh, for savory ones. So uh, we try to keep the uh, kind of like a different concept for coffee. We try to do a little bit of balance of, of sweetness and, and uh, strength and the coffeeness. So uh, we try to have just a little bit of balance of both. So when people come in here, they enjoy it and they don't come in to just get too poor. They just come in and kind of delight in everything that they eat. Back in 2013, my parents were working for this, uh, they are managing a warehouse, both of them together. And uh, the company kind of went down. So they had to let go of both of them. So they had no job and we we're kind of going crazy. So uh, we had just got back from a trip uh, from Paris and they told us, so like, before you come back, you have to try the crepes. So, yeah, we were walking around, we saw crepe places everywhere, and we, we, we tried them and we fell in love. And once we got back here, we got the news that, you know, they had been uh, laid out, out of the job. So uh, we decided, you know, let's, let's try the crepes and let's bring the little flavor of Paris and Phoenix. And my dad's also known for his Café Colado. That's where we got the name from, which is just the pour over that they did in, that they usually do in Mexico. So, you know, we, we kind of incorporated the Mexican flavor to the, you know, French flavor. And that's kind of how we got the, the, the idea and the concept of Colado's Café and Crepes. We have sweet crepes. We started with three crepes. Uh, we had the Nutella, the Tropical, and the Whole Wheat. And those were, you know, very unique. We, we, we did most of those crepes ourselves. And we started adding more. We added a chipotle crepe uh, for lunch, and we needed we needed a breakfast crepe, so we added a morning crepe as well with uh, cheese, uh, so bacon, egg, cheese, and a bell pepper for that one. Our signature coffee is a cafe colado, which is a pour over, and that's kind of just black coffee, uh, and you know you can add sugar or cream if you'd like, but it's it's fresh, it's more personal, and you know people a lot of people like it. And we also have our island latte which is uh, macadamia nut and coconut. So those are kind of the, the exotic flavors that we have. We also have the classic flavors as well. My dad, his name is Bernie, uh, very patient. So we kind of, it uh, contradicts me because he's a patient, he's, he's more patient, I'm more like, you know, let's go. And my mom, Jessica, uh, we all worked here when we started. And then I have my, my younger sister, Jocelyn and Jessia as well. So, you know, we all work. Uh, my mom and parents are kind of stepping out, focusing more on the outside, bigger things. And, you know, we try to manage it here. So it's a family of five, and we have uh, two cousins working here as well, Vladimir and Omar, who have been here from the start. The thing that I'm more, more proud of is our family, that we've gotten to stay together and kind of get closer to each other through this. And kind of the extended family that we created, the people who come here, you know, they're loyal every day, and we kind of get to meet them. And I think we kind of sometimes see them more than their family because they're always here and, you know, we get to talk to them, make connections. And I think that's just the thing that we didn't think that we were going to have. And, you know, it's kind of like a blessing to have, you know, an extended family here and that it can be with you and, you know, you can know them and make a difference in their life.